What's going on, beautiful people? I am here with Jalen Woods, star quarterback for Woodward Academy. Jalen, tonight y'all just defeated a big time rivalry going on over 75 plus years against Maris, 28 to 21. Before we get to the beginning of the game, in their fourth quarter, it's third and 10. Y'all need to make a first down to avoid giving Maris the ball back with a chance to possibly tie the game. You make a, you make a key pass, you get a first down. Then again, going up against the clock, don't want to give Maris the ball back. It's third and short. You get the quarterback sneak. How much did this game motivate you? This game motivated me a lot because of what happened last year. You know, we came out with the win last year, but, you know, Mayor tried to lash, they tried to come back and say that um, he was in, but he really wasn't. So, you know, our motive before the game was to prove to them that we're going to win fair and square this time. It was fair and square last time, but we we're going to pound the rock and we we're going to throw the ball as well, and that's what we did and we executed. Y'all had got a multitude of dudes score tonight from every which way, every way you can think. On the ground, passing, you find multiple receivers. Can you describe, is it even able to be put into words how lethal your offense is? It is because um, Lucas Ferreting stepped up. You know, usually it's been Miles Graham, you know, running the rock. But this game, especially Lucas Ferreting, he stepped up, he ran the ball, he ran the right screens, and he pounded the rock, and along with Ben Grice and Josiah Abdullah. And on Ben Grice's touchdown, you know, what really wasn't talked about is how Josiah blocked him. So I think it's, it's really dangerous to see what we're coming into. Leader of this team, right? Last year you go 11 straight games before losing in the playoffs. You open up this season and you lose your second game in the season. What type of effect did that have on your mental? I think that we actually needed this loss early on in the season. You know, last year coming into the playoffs undefeated, you know, I feel like that was a big wake-up call for us. And having this wake-up call for us in the second game of the season really, you know, motivated us to step our game up and execute to where we know that we can play. <laughs> Your escapability is, was off the charts tonight. Being able to find a receiver when you really needed him the most, you did that time and time again. Is there anything about your preparation or the way you go about practice that's made you so advanced with your skill set? Um, we watch, I watch film every night, you know, coming back home from practice. So I think that really prepared me a lot for um, Maris' defense. And also, you know, I go through my reads. So, you know, if my first option isn't open, then I go my second option, third. Pocket collapses, get out the pocket, you know. And I work for my receivers, the scramble drill. Whenever I scramble, they know where exactly to go. And um, that's what happened today. Finish this statement for me. Woodward Academy will win state if they do. Execute on both sides of the ball, including special teams. We're really dangerous and we're coming for everybody.